cast adds some actors and mm -hmm. two of them rather I don't know I don't know about uh, the acting talents of Blue Beetle adds cast Bruna Marquisian uh, Belisa Escobedo and Harvey uh, Guillen um bruna will play penny the female lead and love interest in blue beetle the yeah. superhero adventure makes history as the first dc film productions to star a latino character mm -hmm. um in addition blue beetle has added belisa escobedo and harvey guillen to the ensemble they join Shola Maridueña, who is set to star in the lead role of Jaime Reyes, the alter ego of Blue Beetle. A vigilante who has a scarab grafted into his spine that gives him tremendous powers and the ability to emit blue energy. Escobedo will play Jaime's younger sister, Milagros, um, which means miracles, that name. Mm -hmm. Guillen's role is wrapped in secrecy and cloaked in mystery, so let the speculation begin, comic fans. Okay, any, any, mm -hmm. any uh, comments there, brother? Ooh, this is, I know I'm trying to imagine. I, this is not something I could just give a quick answer to. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm trying to, I don't know if they're doing, they could be going the route of um, some of the newer Marvel movies where they're creating original characters for these properties. But because if these are, if these actors, actresses are, you know, trying to play characters that are established. I'm trying to tie recognition to some of these, and that well, because that's the comic book lenses in me speaking. I'm not seeing it so far. I'm I'm not seeing it, and mm -hmm. we'll see though. We'll see. Well, I, I well, could be wrong. I just yeah. right now, as of now, I I I hope I don't know. I I just saw a comment Alfred saying Harvey's Ted Cord. I hope not, because that's that's not Ted Cord. I'll just say that that's not Ted Cord. Well, and Harvey Guillen is is wildly talented. I yeah. love him in that what we do in Shadows mm -hmm. TV yeah. show. Yeah, oh, yeah, I like that show. Yeah, so, at least I like the first two seasons. Right, I've only seen one season. I haven't seen you know, uh, you oh, know first but, season and second is fantastic. Oh, cool, cool. I want to talk about the creative team behind this, and uh, this further gives me more more confidence, Nick, mm -hmm. in what's going on. Um, Angel Soto, uh, An Angel uh, Manuel, uh, Manuel Soto, Charm City Kings is set to direct from a script by Gareth Dunet Alcocer, Miss Bala, mm -hmm. which is a kind of narcos Mexico but female lead. If you ever get a chance to see that Miss Bala movie, stars mm -hmm. Gina Rodriguez, kick ass, kick ass. Oh, okay. Um, the film will debut in theaters August 18, 2023. DC's on a roll following the outsized box office success of the Batman. Now, this already needs a, a, a an addendum. Upcoming films include Flash, Aquaman. They have all been pushed back. Yes. I was just really confusing why they did that, especially since now movies are mm. rolling out the way they have been. I'm I'm really confused by that move. But maybe you, something, you know something I don't. Well, let, let's stick to the story because I want to I want to go back to the cast and to, okay. the, to the creative team. Marquise is a relative newcomer whose credits include the Brazilian telenovelas Woman in Love and God Save mm -hmm. the King. Escobedo will appear in Hocus Pocus 2 and has pre previously starred in Sex Appeal, American Horror Stories, and Don't Look Deeper. Gein's past appearances include What We Do in the Shadows and Mickey Mouse Funhouse. Mm -hmm. Um... This cat... Yeah, so listen, Bruna is a gorgeous lady, mm -hmm. uh, young lady, and uh, I think that's it, it. It's what I'm getting is that they're they they filled out the the you know uh, Jaime Reyes's family. We'll see what Harvey's going to be playing. Okay, in the so, DC, yeah, 
I was gonna say, Blissa, I, I, she's, I think she's a Reyes. She's clearly a Reyes. Now that I think about mm-hmm. it. We got mm-hmm. the love interest to the left, and whatever is going on with Harvey on the right. I can't figure out Harvey to save my life. That is, I can. I, I'm starting to see where, where, what's going on, with Blissa. I can mm-hmm. definitely see where that's going. That's she's a Reyes. That's for sure. Mm-hmm. But I, I, Harvey, that's a, that's a big, that's a big mystery there. That's a question mark and a half. My. Excitement level has been going up and up. Okay. And I'll I'll tell you why. Because I believe in this creative team. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This creative team, the director, I've seen his movie. Guy knows how to direct. I've seen this guy's writer. Mm -hmm. Um, These guys aren't PC. And yet they know how to, you know, they know how to, you know, organically, you know, make people happy. But... What I'm getting at is they're, when, they have a long interview that they did in DC Fandom last year. Mm-hmm. The latest one. The 2021? Was, yeah, the last okay. one. Okay. And okay. it was it was horrible. It, the, the whole day was, was horrid, right? Mm-hmm. Except for the Batman trailer and this panel. And the, okay. uh, the, back, the back girl, Leslie Grace, was great too. Um, what I got from the writer and director and Jaime and, and Sholo, they were all on the panel mm-hmm. is their love and attention to Jaime and his family. Mm-hmm. Mm, family. That's, that's a big one, especially in 2022. That, that means a lot to have the family element involved, especially in a superhero story and on top of, of a, of a Latino story. Like, I, I feel like that's definitely whether whether it's your Ecuador or Guatemalan or Mexican, Puerto Rican, a lot of those cultures, family is very, very prominent in all those cultures. Very, very, very prominent, very important. So that that's good. That that's the stick with a tradition. I like that. So I can definitely get with that and right away off the bat, that does give me optimism, which I already was optimistic about this to begin mm-hmm. with. So that just <laughs> That just enhances it, if anything. And that's honestly, that's one of the few DC Comics movies that I'm looking forward to. So I'm, I, I will definitely see that right away when it comes out. That will definitely be an instant. Like that'll, be, that'll definitely be a Thursday night and a Friday night see right away type. That will probably be the one that I actually, you know, do a late night reaction to. It takes a lot for me to do those, but that one would definitely garner me to do it because I want to talk about that. And here is uh oh sorry about that. Here's the cast, and um, Bruna. Better look at Bruna. Yeah, she's definitely the she's definitely the girlfriend, of course. Yeah, we got girlfriend, well, you know, family, and someone else. I think I just I think he's a friend. Yeah, well, I think he's definitely gonna have. Yeah, maybe maybe didn't was he had a, he had a few friends. Um, It'll be a, you know, Harvey's role will have will have some weight. Like he's not going to be like you know in for a scene or two. There's going to no. be some, some good, some good um, twist to him. So I'm, I'm I feel really good about the, about the additions to this this cast. Um, and you know you got yeah I, I, you got a, you got a good diversity within within mm-hmm. you know and uh that's supposed to be it's supposed to actually be this too so now good